Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tanisha. This is your first time watching and I see that my channel grew a lot since I've been gone. So about my channel. So we're all about saving coins over here. Whether we're finding things at discount prices on sale or if we're doing DIYs to save money because saving is key and that's what we're going to do. So I see that I'm pretty sure that y'all came from my DIY uh, videos. This is not a DIY video. Sorry, my bad. But, um... I do have some coming in December, so stick around, don't unsubscribe, but if you're like seeing for the first time, subscribe so you don't miss another upload. To address the, not elephant, where has she been at because we ain't seen you in a long time. Unfortunately, one of my friends passed away um, last month and I've been taking that time to process um, everything and just take that time to myself. But I am back and I'm excited to start filming more videos for you all and try to be a little bit more consistent. So today's video is about five fall trends that you can find at every price point. So if you're someone like me who loves to save some money, shop at the Targets, h and um, department stores, and you'll find these trends there or you can, you can get a little spicy and be it very high fashion go to um Saks, nina markets i got you covered on both price points you can find these trends basically everywhere so let's go ahead and get into today's video so let's go ahead and get into the trends so it's in no particular order except the first two because the first two are like my favorites so trend number one is the jacket and the jacket is a shirt and a jacket together and i absolutely love this trend because in the fall October and now November you could wear the trend because in the south it wasn't really cold at all it's just starting like the temperatures to drop and also I like with the jacket that it can dress up a just a basic outfit and also it looks cute with sweats the first time I saw the jacket was last maybe March this black owned brand called Her Favorite, they actually had it then and I loved it, but it was for one March and I think it was like already warm here down south, but also that was when we were going to quarantine, so I didn't even really need a jacket. So I was excited to see that it was everywhere this fall winter season so the next trend is loungewear loungewear has been a hot commodity ever since march you already know why it's a hot commodity but um for the fall and the winter all the retailers have us covered so from target all the way to zara kim kardashian with her skims they have us covered i love with loungewear you can dress it up or down so trend number three is the lug Big chunky sole boots that like you see everywhere now. Um, I feel like Bottega Veneta was like the first brand that we saw with those type of boots, and literally they're everywhere. And I love the, this about the boot is that you can wear them basically with everything. So as soon as I feel like one wind chill like went by back in september that's like when i saw the boot literally everywhere the outfits that you can do with that boot is endless those potato boots are expensive so um, me personally i ain't buying that but you can find dupes literally everywhere sam elman has a dupe zara has a dupe um you can look on the internet asos asos has a dupe you could look probably anywhere and find the dupe of those boots. But if you got the money to buy the um, Bottegas, go ahead and do you, boo. Go ahead and buy them. So, honorable mention is the Prada Zip Pocket Combat Boot, which I saw last year because Janae from Hilo Lux actually purchased them. And literally, everybody doesn't have them boots on this, like, fall. And you're going to see them in the winter. Like, you're going to see them. And I think that the boots are cute i love them but the price point is like over a thousand dollars super on trend i absolutely love to wear all black in the fall and in the winter so i 
absolutely love it i absolutely love the shirt but if you want to have the boots but at a lower price point but you're not gonna get the um the zip pocket you can get the dot martin's um jadon boots i don't have that actual pair but i have the other pair that is not that chunky but those are basically dupes to me of the boot because it still gives you the same feel as if you got the Pradas. So trend number four is a fedora hat. I feel like accessories are everything and a hat is a great accessory for the fall and winter time. Especially last year I bought a fedora hat from Urban Outfitters. I actually did a video on the hat seeing if it was a dupe of the lack of colors hat which i feel like is a close dupe unfortunately with the um urban outfitters hat is not adjustable and it's one size fits all so if your head is probably like larger than mine's a little bit it's not gonna work for you my bad sorry but i feel like once you put that hat on with a simple basic outfit it kind of elevates your look and makes it look this Let's say high fashion because I don't want to say like more rich because that sounds very bad. This look like a little bit more high fashion. So I would definitely get a fedora hat. The last trend I have for you all are neutrals. Basically, neutrals are everywhere now. I'm not talking like your like your greens and stuff because they're everywhere. But I'm talking like your creams, your taupes, those type of colors. Doing my chromatic looks with those colors. I know I told y'all before I like black for the fall and the winter but I think about stepping away from the dark side and going over there with the neutrals because it just looks more sophisticated and like all together wearing a whole monochromatic outfit with neutrals I absolutely love it and I see a lot of those colors especially like at um H&M and also at Zara like, I'm pretty sure I mentioned those two stores a lot in this video. But, um, Zara has some look, um, Bottega Veneta, like, dupe-looking boots there that's, like, this cream color. And they look so good. And another thing is, like, you can find jackets in that color, too. Like, the color is literally everywhere for the fall and the winter. Like, get into it. So, that's it for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed my five fall winter trends to try at every price point so you can find it all the way at target and you can buy it all the way at sex Fifth avenue like you can find it anywhere so please make sure you like you comment comment um your favorite fall trend winter trend comment that and subscribe so that you don't miss another upload and i will see you all next time bye y'all